we got the Chipotle. I believe that's how you say it. Chipotle? I love the uh, Chipotle hot sauce. I, I put that on almost everything. Uh, so I figured I'd give them a try this year, grow them out, and uh, see if this makes a good uh, uh, um, salad pepper as well as a frying or, or a cooking pepper. And uh, not sure if I'm going to make a chipotle sauce myself this year. But if I get enough peppers off it, I might just try it. I'll do a video on it. Um, you really need a lot of peppers, really, to make it worth your while. Because it's just not worth it, you know, if you only got like 50 or 60 of them. You really want, you know, <laughs> a few hundred so you can ferment them, you know. Well, we'll see what this plant does. I mean, I have a uh, bunch of bunch of other ones coming up here. I may pull them out and transplant them. Uh, but anyway, this is of the smooth stem variety. No fur. It, it's a lot of purpling in the stem. It's quite, if you look, let me try to zoom here. Look at the beautiful stem on that thing. Look at the color on that. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, that that's uh, quite amazing actually. Um, it's of the white flower variety. You see a white flower on it. The leaves are narrow. They're, they're long and narrow. These are the leaves that I'm talking about. They're narrow. They're not like this leaf. Okay, this one's longer and narrower. Um, no fur and here's here's one of the fruits here's a chipotle a young one not ripe yet young i'm not sure if that's a size uh you know mature coming to mature size you can see it compared to my finger right there and it's not very big yet but you can see this is what they look like when they come out and this particular plant if you look at it it's roughly about uh, uh, a little better than two feet right now just eyeballing it and uh, beautiful plant chipotle